Yo! Welcome back to the most genuine fun I've had with a new IP since, like, Splatoon. And, uh, Arms is cool, too, but it's just, it didn't last too long. It didn't last too long. Like, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. Hold on, I'm gonna go check some. See all this money I missed out on? All this money I missed out on because I decided to just beat everything to death. Uh, yeah, <laughs> alright, so uh, we're just going cry across this bridge. I've heard this game is very similar to XCOM. Now, XCOM is a game that I'm super s familiar with. And if familiarity was like some person that I just moved in that I never really talked to, then count me as familiar. We're on a first name basis, baby. But <laughs> anyway, I've never actually played XCOM, and like this has been really fun. Mario, thank goodness you're here. Yours is the first friendly face I've seen since the Mushroom Kingdom turned into this shithole. Your timing couldn't be more perfect. I can't find Toadette. All thanks to changes caused by these odd pipes our rabbit friends brought with them into your world. You guys seem to know what you're doing, sort of. Could you help me find our police blocks? Okay, but well you're going to see how firsthand... A big of a pain this shit is because oh my god this is this is kind of horrible I mean they got like maybe but they look so cool I'll be quiet thank you Beepo just telling the toad to shut up telling the toad to shut up oh my god so the cool thing about this is like this pipe animation immediately makes me think of Super Bomberman 2 versus modes pipe animation there's probably like a total of two people who get it, who I'm saying, but um, basically in the battle mode for Super Bomberman 2, which is probably like the most unique Super Bomberman game, whenever you would go underground, you would flip. Uh oh, is this a Super Mario 3D World bonus world? Oh my god, I'm too well accustomed with this. This also looks like freaking Tron, you know, Tron, you know, not Tron. And we finished it with 10 seconds to spare. Super easy. And what do we get this time? We got Turbine, a new yo-yo for Rabbit Luigi. That's nice. You know what also is nice? Getting into that freaking pipe, uh, pipe cannon. Would that call it a pinning? A oh. pinning? I don't know. I don't know, dude. I think I'm overthinking this. Yo, you can see some fish life down there. That's cool. I wonder if it's cheap cheeps. What's this? What's this? Ooh, hold on. Oh, you can't even go in there normally. I wanted to see if you would just go up and then just straight come back down. That would be funny. This game used to be funny remember when it used to be funny it changed man it changed in these last five minutes it's fucked up well we found tell that now where's our reward all right she's worried about princess peach we need to go back to princess peach's castle certainly not we need to find blah 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 before another message hold on give me one second congratulations i'm getting this far Wise man once said, if I have three hours to chop a tree, I will spend two of them sharpening my ass. I urge you now to return to Princess Peach's castle. Prepare yourself for the fights to come. That's good, but how? You may be wondering how. In the time that it took you to read this email, I have updated your operating system. It now includes a new GPS warp mechanism I call Splong. The name is Work in Progress. Yeah, keep working on it, dude. Anyhow, <laughs> simply activate it and you and your friends will return to Peach's Castle immediately. Signed, your beep, beep, beep. I did all of that perfectly until that end. To that ending part. Also, we're going to Breath of Wild warp out of there. And now we're back at the castle. Back at the castle. That was like my biggest, like, super try hard LP voice. Old school LP voice. We're getting old school, everybody. Mario, thank heavens you're alright. It's good to see you. 
You probably noticed this, but the Mushroom Kingdom has been torn apart. You have to do something, Mario. As usual. Because we're still... Oh, who are your new friends? Allow me, your highness. I am Beepo, an autonomously intelligent scientist. Yeah, I ain't got time to read all that. I see, and <laughs> We call this one Rabbit Luigi. And this is Rabbit Peach. Er, uh, <laughs> she's taking her cosplay a bit too seriously, I, I might add. Cosplay <laughs> in an official Nintendo game? What? Oh, wow. Disgusted with the original. Oh, snap. And got more rabbits just running around. Oh, man. He just body checked the shell, Luigi. Yeah, their friends are also quite uh, spirited, as you can see. It appears as if the rabbits we freed from the Mega Bugs control. What the fuck? What? Control I have ended up here, and no, wor no worse for wear either. <laughs> That's right, they keep popping up. They keep popping in like you do. Alright. Oh my god. They're just beating the shit out of that piece of wood. Yeah, uh, yes, they've been quite busy. I suggest you take a look at what they built when you get a chance. I believe there's something called a battle HQ. And then there's the museum. They love collecting souvenirs from the Mushroom Kingdom. Come let us see for ourselves what your rabbit cousins have been up to. Alright. And now we got Naruto running! <laughs> um, anyway, I'm gonna do all this upgrading and stuff off screen. Alright, so I've equipped my team with all their pixel weapons I've gotten from the free DLC. As you can see here, this one has Honey Chance, Honey Chance, and Push Chance. Honey will keep the enemies in place. Push will also push enemies away. So, after we've done that, let's go check the museum over here. Museum is where you find all the stuff that you kept collected throughout the game. As you can see, there's like a lot of stuff to get. A lot of stuff to get. Aha, look over there. These clever riders have outfitted a cannon so that we can launch us back to the ancient gardens. This comes in handy as our mysterious helper gave me the power to warp the Peach's castle and the cannons can send us back to the front. The ability to return to the Peach's castle at will has even been added to the pause menu. That's nice. That'll be handy. Hopefully in the future when we get some items there will actually like outperform my stat wise pixel items that'll be a good addition. Uh right here we have another little sundial. A sundial. Get it? Because sundials tell the time and this is a button that has the sun in it. Okay. <laughs> Oh, uh, we got to see these more red coin things. Uh, where's the last red coin? <gasps> oh, I've been baited. Oh, never mind. There we go. There we go. Got another golden thing. I don't think this is a weapon. I think this is actually... Oh, I've been wrong before. It's the Bois Blaster. All right, but anyway... Let's go ahead and just return to the uh, the ancient garden. All right, so now that we're back here in the ancient garden, I'm gonna try to hurry up and make this video not that short with no battles and stuff like that. But I definitely want to keep this down to one chapter. Oh, really? It can't be over. Oh, world th one three. There, there we go. That's what I wanted. All right. So we're going to have to hurry up and do these next battles, which will introduce these guys. The Hoppers. Team Jumping Jerks. Ha! <laughs> well, they're one down. Never mind. Ah, oh, fuckers. A new braid of hopping enemies. Team Jump will prove invalid. Here to you, the, the, the words. There we go. I read that whole entire sentence. 
Ooh, actually, there's some secrets here. Some secrets here. Some stuff. Ooh. Also, that has you uh, prepare for stuff. So now, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna actually do some uh, some stuff you wanna learn about until later on. We're gonna blast this guy. Hopefully, he gets pushed back. Ooh, he got pushed. Nice. He's dead. Push and critical. All right, so we're gonna jump through here. I'm gonna get right up here. That way we got a better view of the landscape because you know the higher ground is always better. Um, we're just gonna to switch to Mario. And I need. Let's see. Is anybody enemies out of range? All right. Just gonna skip to their turn, see what they do. They team hop over. Are they gonna shoot him? Oh, they shot Luigi. Oh, fast forward. They shot Luigi again. It's all right because now we'll have Luigi set up over here. So that way he'll be in cover. And we can also fire back from right here. Oh, and he got pushed. So now he's out in the open and exposed. Nice. I'm going to throw Mario right up here. And then there's nowhere to run. And he got honeyed. I'm going to go down here and grab all these coins right quick. And then while we're at the high ground... We're going to switch over to our weapon and just fire from here. Why would you shoot directly at there, man? You got better aim. What is this? Me playing Overwatch? Let's see. Hmm. I really want... You know, we'll just skip to their turn. Nope, he missed. All right, now... Oh no, he's turtling me. He's turtling me. We can't. I can't. I can't allow this. All right. So now that he can't hit me, we're just gonna do this, and then we're gonna get right here and shoot him point blank. No, I didn't do a lot of damage. All right. <laughs> this wall protect me from bullets. Can we stop hitting the fucking blocks? Give me these coins. Give me these goddamn coins. All right, we're just gonna rush him. Just absolutely murder him. Oh wow, we finally get a honey. We finally get a critical and a honey. But it's way too freaking late. Oh my god, they're just targeting Luigi. Poor Luigi. All right, so let's just let's just get right here and blast him with a honey. Can we get uh, can we get our honeys? All right, Mario, jump me up right here. And I'm just gonna blast him point blank. If he wants to hurt me, I got something for him. Push him back. Hit him. There we go. Is he still alive? He is still alive. Perfect. It doesn't matter because he's out in the open. In fact, I can actually do this. Jump right in his face. And we're going to blast him. Right point blank. Nice. Oh, I only took four out of six. Man, I thought it was like a low number. And I thought it was taking forever. All right, um... Where did I go? Oh, I have to go this way because obviously. Now this. This is a very, very, very different game map. If you played, um, I would say like Fire Emblem Path of Radiance. This is like that. Where as long as one of you hit the safe zone, you're fine. And your target is not to go through there. As, the, as you can see... There's like three enemies over there, and there's no cover. If you can see, hold on, I'm gonna get 
get to a better spot. Ooh, honey. He can't move, and he's also dead. <laughs> he is also the dead. All right. So we're going to jump over here. And he shouted he shout the name of a uh, video type. All right, so we're going to switch to Peach. Now, as you can see, there's no cover in here. And there will be enemies spawning in here. So it's best to just stay on the outside, stay woke. You know, neighbors creeping. They're going to find you. Going to catch you sleeping. So uh, we're just going to skip to their turn and see what they do. They're going to run into cover. Obviously, they can't get a good shot on me. So they're not going to take a shot. We got three more rabbits coming up. Which we definitely just want to get the hell out of here. So... Uh, I think I'm going to hit right there. I think that's the safest spot for real, for real. Uh, no good spot to shoot. We can destroy the cover. That would be good. That's a good thing. Go through here. Jump off Peach. Go right here. Keep Ouija safe because he is very low. And if he dies, that's not good. All right. So shoot at him again. Nice. Nice. We've already broken the cover. So we're just going to keep going through here. Put Mario right here. And hopefully this is a critical. Nice. A nice honey. Very nice honey. So now we got three more enemies to deal with. I've actually, I'm actually getting super lucky on this. Because when I first did it, they kind of tried to like murder me super hard. And they were actually about to succeed. Shoot, they might succeed because they're all targeting Mario's cover spot. This might break. Shit, Mario's exposed. Can he get a shot on Mario? Yeah, he can. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh my God, Charles Martinet, you are you are what we need in this world. All right, so. Uh, we're just going to get our quick picks. We're going to get the one guy who's 100%. Oh, critical. Nice. He's done. Down for the count. We're going to switch to uh, Rabbit Luigi. We're going to keep him safe. Move him immediately behind the furthest wall. All right. Just blast him. Nice. And we got a push. That's crazy. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. We're getting extremely lucky this time around. Normally, I <laughs> have a lot of work to do whenever it, get, it comes to getting lucky. <laughs> shoot the cover, because it never hurts to shoot cover when there's nothing left to do. Up oh, here we go. Now you want Luigi. Here you go. Here comes the targets. We got three more popping up. All right, so we're gonna jump off Mario. Actually, how do I want to do this? Can Mario reach over there? That's the question. That is the question I want to know. The answer might surprise you. So uh, we're gonna do this. We're actually gonna play this turn very smart. We're not gonna go straight for the end because I will put uh, Rabbit Luigi in a lot of danger. And I don't want that. Not this early. Um, we're just going to try our best to put a lot of pressure on him. So hopefully, I'm hoping this either hits him. There we go. Look at the luck. Look at the luck. We got this. We got this. Mmm. I'm actually just going to stay right here. Alright, so they're just going to immediately... Oh, shit. This could be bad for Reveille. Oh, they're hitting Mario. Nice. They literally could have shot the cover in. Oh, shit. Shit. Rabbit Luigi's exposed! <gasps> they can go through pipes? No! Rabbit Luigi! Don't worry, I won't let you die. All right, so here's the play. Get him right here. 
and then get Mario next. But first, some payback. Dirtbag. Can I... Hold on. Hold on. I definitely want this kill. I want it so badly. Point blank, baby. That's how we do it. The disrespect. There we go. Blast him right in his face. Remind him of his place in this world. Rabbit Peach. All right, then we're going to super jump. We could just super jump anywhere, but we're just going to jump all the way in the back just for funsies. And we did it. Oh, Jesus. That was so good. Whew, and we kept everybody alive. Yes. There we go. There we go. The gold trophy. Oh, my God. But you know what else we did? We ended off the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the extra long one. Yo, thank you for watching this video. If you find yourself a fan of this content, why not hit the subscribe button so you could be a part of the Moon Peeps? Because even though I call you Peeps, you are all my homies. If you're interested in more Moon Bear, why not follow me on Twitch for when we do our Twitch takeover? And why not follow me on Twitter as well? And if it was your birthday, happy birthday. Internet, you know where to find me.